somebody who is on the journey of soul growth or evolution or a healing journey or any kind of development on your personal growth whatsoever some things that are important to remember is that sometimes we can fall into the trap of feeling like we're never quite healed enough or we're never quite fixed enough or we're just never quite up leveled enough to where we want to get to we start to work deep into the layers of who we are and start to really heal our traumas, our wounds, and really start to face our fears and overcome our obstacles and limitations. What happens is we can sometimes spiral down because we're bringing up a lot of density and a lot of stuff that's been hidden and deep within us for a long time. And sometimes, you know, we can fall into what we call that healing trap or into that dark night of the soul, or you can fall into a really heavy place just as you're releasing different energies and working through different layers. But what is important is that you remember that when you go down, which is a natural part of the process and the journey, you have to remember to pull yourself back up sometimes and take space and time for integration. And in the pause and the space and the time that you take to integrate that you actually start to see the results and you really start to make the biggest shifts that become really apparent in your everyday life. So for example, I've just been on a very intense journey over the last two years and I've been taking time and space to pause and reflect and really let it integrate so I can embody it into my physical body because at the end of the day, your soul chose this body, this vessel, this body, this mind to navigate through this life through, you know, to navigate through this life through. So at the end of the day, physically embodying the shifts that you are taking is very, very important. And when you take that pause in that space, which is often a really uncomfortable place to be, that's when you'll really start to see the effects of the work that you've been doing on yourself and you'll really start to notice the changes uncomfortable because we've been conditioned to believe that we need to be doing and taking action all the time and trust me yes taking action is so important when it comes to trying to create the life you want to create or trying to do something but don't underestimate the power and the potential of the pause taking space and just taking time to embody the work that you have done